guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to teach you guys how to do a round off. This is what your round off should look like. Alright, so when you're going to do your round off, you first have to have a run up and a little bit of a hurdle or a skip, I call it a hurdle though, um, to go into your round off. You're going to hurdle with the leg that you step down into your cartwheel first with. So I have left foot forward, so I'm gonna hurdle with my left foot up before I step down. So this is a little bit what it looks like. So this is what the setup, like the beginning of what my round off is gonna look like. I'm gonna run and then skip. And my hands are ready to go down. So they skip and then right when I touch the ground, then I'm gonna use that momentum to carry my legs over. All right, so now that you have your hurdle, you're starting up, going into your round off, is you're then gonna wanna try just going into a cartwheel right after you do that hurdle. Just to feel you're moving from a run instead of just standing still and attempting your cartwheel. All right, so now that you have that, the next thing to understand is that when you're doing your cartwheel, a round off is different because you're, you end up facing, first of all, the opposite direction, but you land with your two legs together at the same time. For a cartwheel, it's like one foot, then the other. So um, try practicing have, doing a cartwheel, but landing with both feet at the same time. Now that you have that with your legs landing together, now you're gonna wanna try working on getting your pop. And that was, for me, the hardest part to get is how to get my pop. So, when you're trying to get it, is you really wanna push into the ground from your shoulders. You wanna keep your arms straight and just pop off the ground. Give that push so you can land with your hands up instead of landing like this, which looks kinda weird. So that pop is really important because that makes kind of your round off different than just a normal cartwheel with landing with two feet. So things to practice with to just to try to get your pop is to do a handstand and then push from your shoulders with your arms straight. They need to be straight, otherwise it's more of this other movement. You want your arms straight so you can get more air from it. Do go into a handstand and just try popping yourself off the ground and then going back down just to understand how it should feel. So just some things to keep in mind when you're getting working on your round off is just you want to run fast at the start so you can carry that momentum over and keeping your arms straight and just to pop and land soli solidly sorry, uh, facing the other direction that you came from. And there you have your round off. Thank you guys so much for watching.